it's Christina from Christina's Crafts. I just bought these from Walmart um, the other day and I have these chalkboard tags that I got from Dollar Tree and I am going to be doing another Christmas ornament for my tree. So what I'm doing is I am actually just cutting these chalkboard tags um, into a little square like this. And then what I'm going to do is I am going to paint them and I'm going to paint them this um, metallic color paint. So I'm going to get these chopped up and get them painted up. Okay, so I have them cut out and then what I'm going to do is I am just going to cut the corners off of these like this. Okay. So now that I have all the corners cut off, I'm going to take my metallic paint and I am going to put a coat of that on all of my chalkboard tags, just like this. Okay, now that I have these painted, I am ready to move on. So I am going to take my ornaments here that I got from Walmart, if I can get them off. And I'm going to take this ribbon off of here. Let's set these aside. If I can get them off. Well, the other one came out so easy. Okay, there we go. All right, and then I am gonna take my ornament and that is going to get hot glued onto my chalkboard tag. And it's gonna get centered right on there. And then I'm going to take the ribbon and this is going to go on the back to hang up my ornament. Just like that. And then I am going to cut these ends off here. Wait for this to dry. She's pretty warm. Okay, um, I have a couple more of these. I'm gonna go ahead and get those done and then show you what I'm gonna do next. Okay, I have all of those on there, which actually I think it looks pretty nice just the way it is. I love the way that black is underneath that metallic. But I'm gonna go a step further and I'm gonna take my snow text that I got from Amazon. <clears throat> and put a little bit of that around the edges of all of my ornaments. So I just take a little bit out of the jar and take the paintbrush and just kind of paint it on and then every once in a while kind of sometimes scrape the sides of it so that the little chunky part or the little chunks or whatever you want to call it, little grit stays on there. So I'm going to go ahead and get all of my tags done and then I think I'm going to do one more thing, not sure yet. Okay, so there's just one more thing that I'm doing and these actually, I think they look pretty good just by themselves, but of course I'm going to put a little extra on there and I'm just taking some of these diamonds that I got, <clears throat> adhesive diamonds I guess you would call them, and I'm going to put them in the four corners of all of my ornaments. I don't know why, I probably could have just left it the way it was, but I guess I just felt the need to add some bling. So all four corners. And then I think that's pretty much going to be all I'm going to do with this one. So I'll finish up the other ones and then I will be right back. Okay, that is it. They are all finished. Um, this was a pretty easy one. Um, 
didn't cost a lot of money to make. I mean, it was a dollar twenty-five for the tags. Technically, it was a dollar two because I bought those tags last year. Um, and then the ornaments that were from Dollar Tree, two sixty-eight, and then the diamonds were a buck. So. They were pretty cost effective and I think they turned out pretty good. So I would really love it if you like this video, um, share this video, and I would love it if you subscribe to my channel and hit the bell so you get notified when I upload. And take care. Thanks for watching. Bye.